Hello and welcome to this video in the Simplifying Formal series. My name is Michael Kindig and I'm an application engineer with Cadence supporting Jasper Gold. In this presentation, I'd like to explain how formal verification can benefit you as an RTL designer. Formal verification is often thought of as a complex field suited for DV teams, but as I'll show you, formal can be used to provide very high ROI to designers and can even replace unit level simulation altogether. If we look at formal usage during each cycle of development, we can see that it is applicable in many different places, all the way from architecture to post-silicon bug analysis. Working with many customers, we're seeing that designer usage of formal for bug avoidance at the block level is a rapidly growing area. Our customers are realizing that catching bugs early provides the highest ROI and results in higher quality RTL in the finished product. Let's compare Jasper formal usage methods by the designer to those of a formal verification team. Traditional usage of formal by a verification team has the goal of full proofs, bounded proofs, and debug hunting. This will typically be done integrating multiple blocks and using complex constraints in formal coverage. This is very different from designer usage. The most easily adopted approach that designers can use is to leverage Jasper Visualize for design exploration. The goal is to automatically generate waveforms for expected behaviors and then identify bugs while looking at those waveforms. Here we tell Jasper Visualize what target behavior we would like to see. Jasper Formal Engines will automatically create stimulus with the flexibility to modify waveforms as we go. Once you've loaded your design into Jasper, this method often takes just minutes to start generating interesting waveforms to debug. We can extend this design exploration with automatic formal checks. The goal is to remove bugs that can be automatically detected. For example, Jasper Superlink can automatically generate formal properties that can show you how your counter can overflow or can reveal dead code in your RTL. Another example is Jasper CDC, which can structurally analyze your RTL for CDC and RDC issues and formally verify that your custom CDC synchronizer has no protocol violations. Many customers find that using Cadence ABVIP, assertion-based verification IP, along with Jasper, provides high ROI since it can provide the necessary constraints for all of the checks. Cadence ABVIP also allows the designer to catch interface bugs and formally prove their block obeys particular protocols, such as AXI. Designers can completely eliminate unit level simulation altogether by combining these methods and adding user developed SVA for specific functional checks. Once this is completed, the designer can sign off on the highest quality RTL for handoff to the verification team. Let's take a closer look at design exploration using Visualize. Jasper Visualize offers the designer a flexible way to generate and manipulate waveforms. Designers can specify a target expression involving any signals or outputs of your RTL, for example, FIFO full or output packet valid. Visualize will then use formal engines to automatically create a waveform. Once the waveform is produced, the designer has full access to all signals along with an annotated source browser. Y analysis automatically plots relevant signal causing a particular signal to transition in a specific cycle. And you have the ability to highlight differences between two waveforms. The designer can change the signal behavior in the waveform using wave edit. The waveform length can be extended to see what happens in the future. Constraints can be added on the fly and quiet trace capability allows the designer to minimize unnecessary signal transitions to make debug easier. For automatic formal checking, designers should start by using Jasper Gold Superlint. Comprehensive structural and DFT checks are provided such as coding style, sim synth mismatch, and DFT controllability and observability. Superlint builds upon these structural checks by creating automatic formal checks based on your RTL. Using these checks, Superlink can identify behavioral problems such as arithmetic overflow, dead code, and FSM live lock and deadlock. Designers can observe failure waveforms using the same visualized debug environment that they used when exploring the design. Resilient waivers make it easy to ignore certain warnings as the RTL is changing, and automatic waivers can be generated to reduce linting noise. This comprehensive set of functional checks, violation debug, and waiver handling is based on best in class formal analysis. When we combine design exploration, automatic formal checks, and designer developed SVA, we can see that the designer has a powerful way to eliminate bugs and achieve RTL sign off at the earliest point in the development cycle. This example shows that each of these common bugs can be detected by one or more of the methods shown. 
The important takeaway here is that for all of the bugs listed, the designer has a high likelihood of detecting each type of bug without any simulation. These methods are all relying on Jasper Gold formal property verification, Superlint, and CDC apps, as well as optional cadence ABVIP for interface checks. The takeaway here is that formal provides a comprehensive and efficient way for designers to create the highest quality RTL. Formal can provide a designer with robust unit level analysis, catching bugs as early as possible to reduce development cost. Designers can start with simple design exploration using Visualize. Automatic formal checks in Superlint and CDC apps can easily be added along with optional ABVIP to provide interface checks and constraints. And after seeing the power of these checks, designers may choose to add their own functional SVA properties, allowing them to completely replace unit level simulation. Thanks for watching and don't forget to check back for more videos in this simplifying formal series.